Warning, this podcast may contain content not suitable for children and may contain some adult language and situations that should not be repeated. And we advise that you receive parental permission before viewing. You have been warned. Yeah. How do you want to introduce today? Or How would you know if it's a movie maker file? How would you... <laughs> <laughs> Ow! <laughs> you dick! Because I'll fucking know. That's how I'll know. <laughs> we can just have that at the intro. <laughs> when it doesn't have to go through Dropbox just so he can have yeah. it. Oh. I feel so cheated on. You were like, you see, how do you know? <laughs> how would I know? You're right. How would I you know? Would, <laughs> I would it doesn't know. say, by the way, this was made in movie maker. No, like, it's the format. It's MP4 or some shit like that. You can fucking Unless I oh save a draft. Unless I save a draft that's yeah. like movie maker file. Which you know what to do? Okay, okay. You know what? I, you know how I would, I would know? I would ask for your ROGs. I would ask, where are your raw files? Which means any PNG files that you use, any audio files that you use, any snippets or versions. Or you could just ask, because I can't lie. <laughs> you can't lie. You're right. And with that, welcome to the Blind Eye Podcast. Today, joining me, Matt, we have both Joshes. Yeah. yeah. Josh Pinion, Josh Carling. Do you guess which one is this one? I don't know which one is this one. That's true. Josh, what's your favorite pop tart? Uh, it's cinnamon and that one <laughs> where it's the it's like it's like a swirl, like a purple swirl on a blue background. Okay, besides the purple swirl, fuck you, you're dead to me. <laughs> what? Brown, the brown sugar cinnamon. It's the worst one. I like according, it because of the texture. Because okay, it according to me, heartburn. The reason he brings this up is because he was listening to another podcast on another YouTube channel. What is it, Sleepy Cast or something like that? Sleepy Cabin. Sleepy Cabin. And, they, and someone asked them, like, what's your favorite Pop-Tart? And they got into this, like, 30-minute argument about the best Pop-Tart versus the worst Pop-Tart and why. Um, the brown sugar cinnamon is the cheapest because it's the least amount of, like, flavor and nonsense in it. It's literally... It's like you just take raw sugar and just put it in a pastry, and that's it. Like, there's no making of the frosting. There's no extract for the fruit flavoring. What about I you? mean, and we know, I know it's bad for you. I know that... Bread, the, the brown jelly. sugar cinnamon? No, no, no. The jelly filling? Oh, well, man. That shit's bad for you. But yeah. At least oh. it takes a process and shit. Right. So it's, does murder, yeah. but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. You know, there's suicide. That's so freaking easy and cheap, <laughs> but then there's murder. No, listen. Alan and I were talking about that. Was it? When the Sunday when you guys were out in nature, we were playing D&D that night. But while you guys were out, you know, getting one with your nature shit. I hate nature. I know you. I saw your face. It was all. I'm like, just like I regret, regret. I regret everything. A bee started chasing me, man. I was like. <laughs> 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 For the record, since this is audio, he stood up and did some twitch. But anyway, I had, uh, was we were talking about like what would it take to cut a person, you know, in half, or like what what would it take to like, oh, you to, like sever to... the limbs? And be like, that's so much effort. Why would it? Why would a mass murderer want to become? A murderer. It's it, like so much effort. All right, it depends so much what work. you use right. and where you're cutting. Yeah. Like, say if you had a Motomasa sword. Yeah. You're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> you just could, cut at the knee. You could cut at the knee and put it like in an angle oh, so you're going past the knee. That was my knee! And through the rest of the leg. Right. But Motomasa swords are really, really fucking sharp. What? Dude. You mean katana blades? You, no, they're, they're a certain kind of katana. They're, uh, oh, I know there's levels. Yeah, they're, it's a, it's a yeah, swordsmith see, that literally, like, pledged to the gods, like, make my weapons great. Okay. They did, but they made them cursed. So if you use them, you become, like, bloodlust. Are you fucking... Okay, this is... We're talking about real... No, no, like, no they were. It's, it's just a it's superstition, but all of them are gone now, I think. Right. Or unless there's someone on display. Jacob, awesome. Jacob, Jacob ru- mostly harms Jacob. That's what, that's what I think what his name is. Yeah. Brought up, in, brought up a point that katanas would be good for cutting limbs and whatnot, but then Alan countered with like, okay, but then you would only have to use it, or you could only use it once. Because, what is it? After you use it that first time, it's chipped, it's dull, you gotta no. take so much time to sharpen it up again. I believe that. You could cut at, like, the neck, but you have to get in between the vertebrae. Yeah. It's just if you're skilled in it. Have so, you seen, have you seen uh, Deadliest Warrior uh, on Spike TV uh, when it used to be on? 
Uh, good tangent. I used to only use watch Spike TV for the perverted shit, but okay. Well, a thousand ways to die. A thousand ways to die, die and yeah. Mansers. Mansers was actually pretty funny. She tried what? deep throating no. a cucumber. Well, what was it? It did not. In one of Deadliest Warriors, there were several instances in their episodes where they actually had a katana blade and they actually tested how strong or how deep no, it was. No, I was talking about the perverted shit, like the what is it? The sex cartoon Stripperella. You remember that's, that? That's fine, but. Oh. Well, we're talking about katana blades. I know, I know, but that was like <clears throat> one one way to test how sharp a katana blade is right. to see how many um, things it can cut through. Like they literally stacked uh, so many amount of like pig carcasses on top of each other, like fresh, because that's the closest thing to human flesh. Uh -huh. And let's let's say for argument's sake that it had four brand new, like fully like filled carcasses, like it. All the inside all the organs and stuff. They're cleaned up. So the guy just takes the katana blade, just goes straight down through, and out of the four, three were cut in half. Boom, just like that. And they're just like, holy fucking shit. <laughs> if that can go through that many pigs that easily, just imagine what it can do when it hits bone on a, on a per other person. And you're just like, I'm, I'm never getting in a fight with this man. No, <laughs> please no. man with a katana, run. <laughs> oh, hey, have you ever put a butter on a Pop-Tart? What? No. Right? See? Right? Why is this weird? Because it's fucking weird. Okay, next time you what? just because family. Oh, no, 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 not, not, not next time. No, no, no. We're not doing that. No, 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 no. no, no, no. Hear me out. Hear me out. Just because Family Guy sings a song about it doesn't mean everybody fucking does it. It's no. a sick. No, no. It's a sick way to live. They put that. They put that song in Family Guy so that other people can possibly try it. No. It's a question. The song was literally a question. It was a basic question. <coughs> sex. What you do, sure, why not? <laughs> yes. Here, you like the brown sugar cinnamon ring, right? Do you ever... Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> What's the matter? <laughs> I caught him in the middle of drinking some soda, so yeah, he's, he's like, brown up. sugar. And cinnamon. You want some brown sugar? <laughs> okay, you know, you like the brown sugar cinnamon Pop-Tart. Yeah. Do you ever toast it? Uh, no. Okay. okay, I do that from time to time, but That's I also like sick. I also like it toasted. What okay, at least hear, it. hear me out on this. Try it. Just okay. try it. If you don't like it, you don't have to do it again. Don't do it. Fuck that roll. He's trying to yeah. He's a cultist. Lightly, He's trying to bring you lightly in. toast the brown sugar cinnamon and then put a thin layer of butter on top and tell me what it tastes what like. Top? Like the icing top? The icing top. Are you upside down? So then put it on that side. It doesn't fucking matter. So long as you put butter on the Pop Tart. Put a thin layer. If it doesn't change the taste for you, or if it doesn't add like a little extra thing, because I like it with the extra but like the little extra layer of butter, because it adds that little like sweetness to it, yeah. a little extra sweetness. And then I take a glass of milk on the side, and I'm like, oh, this is this is heaven right here. Let, let me ask you a question. You like mac and cheese, right? I'm afraid of where this is going. You like mac and cheese? Yes. Right? All right. Take ketchup, like the all natural ketchup, the one that they sell in the routes. You lost me. And squirt a little bit into the macaroni and cheese and swirl it. You, you lost me there. Yeah, but it, it adds to it. It tastes good. You know what? I'm going to try that now. Okay. No, I'm going to try that It now. tastes good. It, it makes wait, a wait, little... Wait, wait, you do that? Yeah. Oh, oh shit. So, sometimes. I, like, at times, if it's with the craft, really... With if the craft it's, boxes? If it's those, like, shells with, like, the white sauce, it's just like... Oh. No. <laughs> I'm not touching that. I'm leaving it exactly as is. It's beautiful. You know, do you do it with the craft boxes? Yes. Oh, okay. So... Just like a little dollop? Just just like probably a couple a couple squirts. Oh, I I just I'm gonna try that. I just reentered this conversation because I'm currently editing the videos right now. Fuck craft. Why? I hate craft. Screw I'm you, man. Craft. I hate craft. It's so fucking fake. Well, I respect food. Okay. You can respect food all you want. Yeah. I'm gonna respect my food too. You're, I prefer you're, you're I right prefer to respect your lives. I prefer to respect. Homemade mac and cheese, and my mom and my family can make the same homemade mac and cheese. Beautiful, right? And it's amazing. It's, I love it. It's awesome. It's, more, it's almost like a fluffy souffle. Yeah. However, you can't go wrong with a good yes, box of can. mac and cheese. You, <laughs> yes, you can. Oh, god damn it, dude. I just, I just misspelled Minecraft, yeah. and it's Hitler everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> what did you, how do you Mine know for... Hump? Oh god! Oh, yeah, yeah. Minecraft! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh, fucking hot here. Here. This episode is brought to you by Minecraft. <laughs> Minecraft. I struggle <laughs> with this. Just Hi this. Hail the drink. Hail Hydra. Hail Hydra. Yes. Hey, so speaking. Hey, 
Facebook. It's Facebook. so stupid. I'm just laughing uh, my ass off. Oh my god. Oh, wait, Rick's Facebook yeah. thing no, no, no. for it. When like the soldiers are like, hey, Hydra. That's their thing though. I know, but it's like, choose a different salute, please. Oh my gosh. Hey, speaking of salutes. <laughs> right? <laughs> like, you guys trying to be Superman? That's not how it works. Hey, speaking of Superman. Right, Someone so. should make a meme of that. Just like, okay, guys, on three, we're all kind of fight. Three, two, one, go! Yeah! And they're all standing there going, What's going on? This is going on! This doesn't work. He didn't. No. Hey, well, you were uh, wanting to tell us about that dream you had. Oh, yeah, uh, the naked one. Oh, God. Okay, he, so. Where he was using his penis as a sword. Right? I was not! <laughs> I was not using my penis as a sword. Liar! Alright, how it happened was it, the dream entered in on, it was me, it was Matt, All right. we're in a room, and it's Maddie, and this other girl, um, shit, should I say name? Uh, uh if you, for the uh, sake of argument, let's say no. Alright, so let's So, go. then there was no, and we're all <laughs> relaxing in the room after some- Just give her an alias. Yeah, no. Alias? Yeah, no, like Alice. There you go. There. For the sake of Alice. argument, for the story, her that's name my is Alice. mom's name. Do you not want me to say? Name her Markiplier. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm uh, sex with my mom. Jesus. Whoa, whoa, that got dark. Jane. What'd you look up? What about Jane? Just no, Jane. you getting oh. that was dark. Have yeah, because he fucking said my mom's name. And I was like, can no, we I stop talking that. about your mom, please? <laughs> Why? Jane. Why? Do you think you're not good enough Jane. to talk okay. about his mom? Jane. Okay, first Stop time. it! Alright. Jack Chen's niece when she grew up. Go. No. Fuck! Yes! <laughs> yes! yes! <laughs> Dude, you have no idea how hard I was crushing on that. I was just how like... he was four. There you go. Like, for should I feel right bad now. right now? Because she's still young, but then she's old and is high. <laughs> yeah, but the weird thing was she kept the same head even after she grew up. Yeah, which makes you feel like, what if she's special? Special? Like, that would look weird. Like, uh, like a Why 25 year old that? woman with like a 12 year old girl's head. God damn, I'm sweating, man. Right? But anyway, uh, so it's me, Matt, Maddie, and Jane. Jane. Alright. And we're relaxing after some food good. Food good! And. It's something you do with your hands. Suddenly, like out of nowhere, someone just freaking kicks in the door and just like, like at first it's just five guys. Five guys come out with freaking swords. Not like katanas, like Kill Bill, but like uh, short swords. How about these, human? It's like you. And I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> so they start charging me. One guy lunges at me, like straight forward, and I swirl around on the opposite side of his arm, so the outside of his arm, and I kind of hook my arm on his arm, and his elbow is against my back, and I just turn, and his arm bends backwards, and he drops his sword. I then catch the sword before it hits the ground and swing up. Like that, and it takes off his head. All right. And then the other guys start coming at me. I take another sword, and I just start dual wielding like fucking crazy. Fifty guys come in, and you guys in your are. Room. I'm pretty sure you're fighting. In but your room? No, no, just in a room. I don't even know what this room is. Okay, because I was gonna say it if just, that was your it, room, that would be possible. It, it looked like a room of requirement. I'll say that. We're done. So Why? room room of requirement it, as reference to D and D. Wait, wait. Room requirement. That's a real thing, or is that a Harry Potter thing? It's, it's just a Harry Potter. It's thing. a Harry Potter thing. Oh, I'm tired. Of it's just fucking Harry Potter references. Anyway, <laughs> right, we, we use that as a nickname for the room that we're in. I'm in fucking D &D. 23. I'm over that shit. Anyway, <laughs> so you're. I'm pretty sure you're fighting too, but the two girls are over in the corner. Going, ah! You know, like like help us, please. Oh gosh. So we're fighting. We're fighting. It, the battle rages on. I'm pretty sure there's some like music in the background for ambiance and. Battle's over, I'm naked, you're naked, yeah, and we're just walking over the corpses, and we're just red. Just completely red. Matt goes like, do we want to do it again? No, it's like, we're just walking around, just and over these bodies. I, you got that pumping of blood, and you're just like, ah. <laughs> like, I, like, I just did that. And then I wake, and this is a two-part dream, I wake up, but in a dream. It's like I snapped out of daydreaming at work. You had an inception. And I'm standing there at work, and Christian, one of my coworkers, is there. I just said his name. Christian's there, and he's like, so yeah, uh, we got this copyright thing, and now I owe a fine of $500. I just turn over to him. I go, shit, man, that sounds horrible. And I just look away, and I'm like, that was a weird daydream. And then I wake up, and I'm grinding my teeth, and my feet are, and they, they look like, you know how a puppy kind of runs in its sleep? Yeah. I was doing that, apparently. 
Anyway, that was it. That was weird. Dude, that's just one of my weird dreams. I have probably one every night. If I'm lucky, I don't dream. I just fall asleep, wake right. up. I feel fine. Oh, okay. Moving on. Have you had any strange dreams in the last recent days, Pina? Uh, I, you know what? I feel like I did, but... <clears throat> you can't remember? Yeah, it's one of those moments where, like, I remember the dream in the morning of, and I keep thinking about it even in the afternoon of, and then, like, as soon as dinner time rolls around, I'm like, what was I dreaming about last night? It's talking about it. Yeah. And you talk, I can't remember dreaming dream that's from about So, do you just, like, constantly talk about swinging a sword with your dick out? No. That was uh, last night. That's why it's easy to remember. Oh. But there was a dream I had about ten years ago, and it was about... It was like a, one of them was a nuclear detonation. I ran into a closet, closed the door. Oh. But then the second dream was like before that. And it was me opening that door to the barren wasteland. Mm. And then to my friend running past me going, what are you doing here? You gotta run and blah, blah, blah. And we're yeah. running, we're running away from these guys in gas masks that are shooting us. Oh. Apparently because we've been mutated. Oh. I don't know. Maybe in quotations, maybe. I think I had a dream like two nights ago where like, uh, Chris and I were like put to this uh, this trial, this crucible almost, and um, <clears throat> like this crucible, this you know tournament, I guess you could say, was like run by a stupid, dumb looking monster mash Dracula, that sort of thing. Like it he was, was a just, monster. He was so it campy, was he was so hilarious, but like the stakes were so fucking scary. Like I had to battle a couple monsters, and she had to like go through like this American Ninja shit. That I want to do Ninja that. Warrior, where, like she has to Super run through bad. obstacles. Like, what's that old video game on the Atari where, like, uh, like Maze Runner or like I don't know, something we have to jump over shit. I don't know. But um, what is it? The final trial was like we had to face off each other, like fight each other. Yeah, in order to get out of this, uh, this you know, this what you do? Other dimension. Yeah, fuck that. I'm not losing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was. Uh, it was like a moment, I couldn't, I can't remember what I said, but it was like some heartfelt moment, like, I can't oh. do this, I love you. Did she yeah. take off your head? Yeah, <laughs> I think so. I Did she just like, fuck it? Was, it was either that, or I like threw my sword at like where the, where the Dracula was, and like he died, and like everything lit up, like day, daytime finally came out, that sort of thing. It was like, it actually kind of got to me the next morning, and I was like, oh my god, would that actually happen? Yeah. Would she cut off my head? She'd probably do that. Oh, but like I a mother that. spider to its husband. <laughs> oh no, but I love her. I truly love her. For now. To be like, you want my pencil? Until she picks up a sword hand. and you flinch. <laughs> <laughs> she's gonna just pick up one of the swords at the at the game room and you're just gonna be like, <laughs> Right? <laughs> uh, hot, what are you doing with that? Uh, could you put oh, it down? Nothing, please? nothing, you know. Just I like, like swords. They're fun! fun. Just get off. <laughs> she used to sword play. She used to sword fight, so I'm fucking scared of her. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. My dreams have been about sex recently. Yeah, let's hear sex dreams. I don't even know, bro. Okay, the first one that came to my mind just now. You had now, four dicks. Yeah, dude, just like a koala, man. Yeah, you had four dicks. I knew it. Called it. <laughs> no. You get freaked out no. when I talk okay. about vaginas. Why can't no, I talk no, about penises? No, no, I, I don't like... No, I don't mind talking about dicks. It's just, for one, I don't like saying the official one. names of those parts. He finds it more awkward to say dick than it is to say penis. No, no, no. no. I no, find no. it more awkward to say penis than dick. Because penis sounds so fucking weird. But it's the, it's the scientific term. Penis! No, no, no. It's the actual what is it? Scholarly accepted Would you penis? rather not it be like Stewie and not be able to pronounce the words? Legs. Insert penis into a vagina. A vagina? A vagina. 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 It looks like a curtain. Else. Where'd that come from, Vijay? Vijay is yeah. a it's a it's a street term. It's, it's a street term, it's right? slang. Yeah, it's slang. <laughs> we should start. We should start with Vijine. <laughs> I think I just remembered a comic strip. <laughs> and it fucking has a word bubble. Kakarot. I just, I just, I just remember. Oh my god! <laughs> that was great. Oh my god, that was I great. I just remembered a comic strip where it was a dad and a kid. Like a, like a young kid, and the kid goes, Dad, where do babies come from? And he goes, one second. Gets up, opens the front door, walks outside, and there's curtains by the window. And he opens the window and starts, like, he closes the curtains, but you can't see him yet. But then he starts crawling through the curtains, naked and covered in, I don't know what, but, like, Honey Hunt Cheerios or some shit. And he's just like, <laughs> And the kid just gets up and starts running away. Like, no! <laughs> it's 
So fuck you. <laughs> I feel like, what would you do if, like, your... Oh, sorry, you know what? You had your sex Give dream. Him. What was it? I want to hear it. Okay, well, what? the first the first dream that I was thinking of was that I was this close to having sex with a co-worker. About an inch. About an inch apart fingers. Apart fingers. Is oh, it? <laughs> I was <laughs> doing this. I was, oh, okay. I was I was this close to having sex with my with my coworker. These I was like, close. These close, close. These close. About an inch, and I was there. I'm like, oh. So wait, wait, wait. So your your dick was an no. inch away from the vagina. No, 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 no. Oh, not like that. To hug like, anyone, you be that like, far. Well, like, you were saying like inch, like, like literally an inch. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, moving on. I have a timer. Go sit down. I have a timer. <laughs> What, what, what I was going to say is, like, everyone's at a party and whatnot, and I just so happen to see my coworker there. Everyone's drinking, having a good time, and all of a sudden, it, the two of us slowly migrate to one of the bedrooms, and it, like, slowly, you know, pieces coming off, and there's talking. I don't remember the dialogue. All I remember is, it, and it came in waves, you know, where you have a dream, and then you're in one spot, and then next thing you know, boom, you're in another spot, and then boom, you're in another spot, but it all makes sense. Yeah. That's what was happening. So, it was, like, slowly pieces coming off, and it was, like... You know, tossing and turning on the bed, but no like actual. This sounds like an actual movie scene. Yeah, like, right. that's kind of what they do in the movie. Yeah, like, like call hot, 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 skit, hot, 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 skit. Hot, no, hot, but hot, here's skit, the here's and the weird done. thing. No actual physical thing happened. It was just more of like. Was it like that scene from Forty Days and Forty Nights where like they're caressing each other because they took this? Have you seen that movie? It was like they, these two people took an oath to not have sex for for Lent, and so. The, was the dude has like a raging heart on like every day wait i think maybe yeah. yeah so like the one night they decide to get together they don't have sex but they like rub against each other or something oh, like, like dry humping and yeah shit? like almost like that, that well that. okay just imagine that all right if, if that's a good analogy think of that but we were naked and then next thing you know all i all i can remember at that particular moment was us cuddling i'm just like what kind of fucking dream is that I don't even see the good part. It's dude, the, that is a movie scene. <laughs> that's a movie. That is an actual dude. That's just thing, watch. Right? That's that's, that's just when watch. I realized I was in a fucking dream. I was just like, God fucking damn it! And then that's when the dream. Just you're fucking laying there. Wouldn't it be weird? Shit! Wouldn't it be <laughs> weird, Josh? Wouldn't it be weird if like you had sex that night and then you had a dream about having sex with that person directly after you had sex? That'd be bonus, right? Because what? No. What? What's weird to me is having dreams and then like. I don't know how much time passes, but then that dream that you had completely mirrors this reality mm. in some way. Because I had a dream, I don't know how long ago, but the dream was basically I was standing next to a car. And my dad and my sister were lifting something into the car. Mm. They said, how about we drop it at, off at your place? And then I say, no, mom's going to be there. And then I wake up. That's it. That's the end of the dream. That's gotta be like you want your money back, cause that's like the worst dream ever. Yeah, no, no, no. It's it's. I I used to have like rapid fire dreams where I would just have like ten of them in one go because I have insomnia. I don't sleep very well. I'll, I'll go into deep sleep and then come out of it. Deep sleep, come out of it. But I'm. It's. I think it's like my mom's birthday, and we're getting her something, and my dad's helping, and we're loading the present into the car, and they said we can drop this off at your place. I go, no, mom's gonna be there, so she'll see it, and I just stop and go, whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> and I they go, what? I go, shh. And they go, are you okay? I go, I swear to God, I had a dream about this moment. And they're like, really? I go, yes. What the hell? Have you ever had people try to break down your dreams? Yeah, I yeah. fucking shut them up because it's stupid. I hate it. No, some of it. Some you of know, I could break down your dream about your dream. I, I don't want to. You want me to? It's, it's no, some of it I want to can. enjoy. I no. Let well, me, here's the thing. You can still through, enjoy it yeah. because there's probably some sort of underlying reason as to why you're having that dream. Right. I'll tell like, you later. Here, here's here's an example. No, no, okay, here's yeah. an example. My okay. friend, who was going through a bit of a, <clears throat> um, sort of a rough patch in their life, right. and they were sort of you know not. Not exactly making uh, the the best of decisions for themselves. They they basically regretted a lot of what they were doing, yeah. but this is what they were going through. Um, she was sort of conflicted at the moment uh, between certain certain guys. She was she had strong relationships with each person, but each person was causing some sort of personal problem for her in terms of relationship. Right. So there was this one dream that she described to me saying how she was sort of up in the clouds just like flying and just enjoying the air like a regular bird would or Superman let's say and, and he's, I dropped 
<laughs> and then she says, she, she sort of looks down, and on the floor you see three frogs playing leapfrog over each other, trying to jump and reach at her level. And she was just like, I woke up because it was so funny, yet at the same time I was confused as to what happened. And I was, I literally broke down her dream because it was that simple. Mm. It's like, you're up in this level of bliss because you do not want a relationship right now yet people are causing you problems so you want to be left alone and then these three guys right here are trying to reach you but have no way of actually getting a hold of you and make them you theirs because you're in such a state of mind mm. and she's just like nah that's just a funny dream <laughs> <laughs> she's just like nah let's just leave it as a funny dream there i'm like go. all right don't you don't you don't want the truth that's fine well, I, I woke up this morning i coughed up blood you know i'm not sure what that is so well you probably have this Nah, it's probably, <laughs> it's, probably, it's probably something I ate. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, you're dying, dude. You're screwed. This... I can break down your dream, but I'm not sure if you'd want me to. Um, random scene from a different random dream that I had. I was talking to a different coworker, and she was pregnant. I was just like, hey, when did that happen? She's like, shh. And then Dr. Phil it. comes out, and he says, you're the father. That would have been really weird. And I think I know why I had that particular part of Wait, wait, wait. No, do not Dr. Phil. Who is that guy who like always reads off the thing? Like, you are not the father, or something like that. Oh, oh that's... Uh, oh, fuck. That Jerry? Be... No, no, that's not Jerry. Not Jerry. 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 No, it's not Jerry. It's, uh, it's an older guy. He looks... Uh, been there, though. Yeah. But, okay, go on. Matt. Oh, okay. I think I know why I had that random scene in that random dream. It's because the my one coworker felt like she was gaining a little weight. And to an extent, you can sort of see it, but she's still very... The, the one you, you were trying to draw the picture for. What? Oh! Oh, God. Ooh. So she said she was getting a little, just a little, little, you know, filled, so to speak. Oh, so, <laughs> so I'm sorry, I just got mental. No, you don't. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a turkey face to be like. <laughs> she to just try, so try she, that she feels like she's getting a little bit uh, chubbier. So you know, I was just like, huh. How does it work? How does it work? And then all of a sudden that sort of translated into pregnancy. Right. And then she's like, shh, I'm very proud of it. It's a secret. I'm like, how is that a secret? You can clearly see the, the hump. I'm, I'm getting fat. Le bulge. Le bulge. Le bulge. Do not disturb the lump. Oh, gosh. Yeah, it's going to kick you right back. And then, there's the, uh, and, then there, and then there's the random scene of titties. Titties? Titties. Why not? I'm so jealous. I don't think I've had a sex dream yet. Dude, I, I don't really know if you can call you, what I have sex dreams as much as they are just teases. Have you had a wet dream where you wake up and you finished? Funny story. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Okay, I, I want to oh, say hold on, Matt, Matt. Define finished. Finish. As finish. in you, you, you came in your bed. Yes. That, isn't that the? the isn't that the? What that always happens at a wet no. dream? No. 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 You, you wake, wake up, up and you, you, have a, you have a metallic kickstand in your bed. That's right. that's most sex dreams. All right. But if you haven't taken care of yourself in a while, you could possibly accidentally finish, you know? <laughs> I, I want to say no because I don't think I have. And I say I don't think. I may have, but I won't remember. One time. One time? I was the weirdest Here, fucking This dream. is, okay. I don't, this, this happened... Okay, I'm, this is going to be like straight up like confession on the thing, so this is going to suck. Right. Because people are going to find this online and be like, ha, this guy peed the bed. This is, I woke up. Anybody who yells at another person or like laughs at another person for peeing the bed, fuck that guy because I know for a fact he's peed his bed also. Yeah. No, well here's the thing. All right. Here's the thing. It was in the middle of a dream, okay? <laughs> this is going to get really weird. I have one right after you. This is okay? going to get really weird, okay? Right, this dream's going to get really go. weird. We got, so I don't, we got I, time, we got time. I don't know how old I was. I might have been 14, 15. And this was a really strange dream. I'm at the beach having a good time with some friends. I don't remember who was there. at the, But I was like, hey, I'm going to go over here and take a piss because there's no one else here on the beach. It's just us. And I, I go up to uh, the tide line where the waves are breaking. And I'm just like over here. I'm turning in the other direction so no one can you know, see my wiener hanging out and so on. Wiener. I'm peeing. All of a sudden... <laughs> My dick just gets longer and bigger and bigger. I'm just like, what? What the fuck's going on? I can't. I can't hear it. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, what the fuck? I'm scared. <laughs> Help me! Over the Help shoulder. Me. Over the shoulder. No, it was. It was no. It was hard. It was like, 
Oh, it was just sticking. It's like out getting it's heavy, like, so you're falling forward or something. It's like so, no, I was just like, Whoa, what's going on? And it's just extending, like extendo arms, st- stretchy finger, extendo arm, whatever. Yeah. And I'm just like, I woke up because I was just like, what the fuck was that? And I look at my bed. And I'm like, Are you fucking kidding me right now? And I was like, I had to go to the bathroom. That's why I had that dream. You piece of shit, dick. I had a dream where I was at someone's house. Oh, you do it at somebody. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I was at someone. No, no, I wasn't at someone's house. I was in my own house. But the dream was you I was at someone's else. house. Okay. So I'm, I'm at this person's house, and we're just talking, chatting it up, laugh, laugh, ha, 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 you know. And oh crap, I gotta go to the bathroom. I'll be right back. And he's like, okay, the bathroom's right over there. I go, cool. I go over to the bathroom. And I'm standing there, and then I realize something that my vision is in the third person. And that's most times in my dreams is I can see myself. It's like a movie. Yeah. And then at that moment, I'm already starting to pee, and then I am laying, I, I sleep on my stomach. So I'm laying on my stomach, but in my dream, I'm like, zip, and I'm like, wait. And then I see, <laughs> I see it right here. I'm just like, like that, and then I just push off of my bed go, no! <laughs> I just, like, I just, a little bit, it was just in my pants, and I'm like, Thank God! Like, I don't give a shit about my pants, but I, not the bed. Not the I bed! Honestly, that, that's so meta. It's like, wow, you caught yourself before! Because I could feel it. I'm just like, I immediately pushed off my bed, just going, I don't want to get this wet. I'm like, what happened was, this is probably going to hurt like a bitch, but, like, I'm laying on the ground like that. Right. Or not on the ground, but on the bed. I just go, no! <laughs> like that. I just roll over. For the record, he went on the floor and rolled it for oh, demonstration. At least you caught yourself. For me, yeah. I found a small little puddle in my sheets. I was like, fucking A, I gotta change my sheets now. Okay. I hid it from my parents. So they That's were like, why I was happy. I didn't want my mom to go, <laughs> yeah, you right? your bed, didn't you? <laughs> my parents probably, my mom would probably know because she, cha- she does the fucking laundry, but I'm just like, who, who the fuck what's their bed at that age? And you're just like, oh, God damn it. What was the last thing we wanted to talk about? Uh, well, we were talking about Pop-Tarts. We were talking about, uh, like, the dreams. Most, most shit that's been happening to us. This is a good kind of thing, how we just chat. <sighs> it's hot yeah. in here. It is really fucking hot. I it's opened like, the window, but only a little bit. It's not going anywhere, though. It's, 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 it's getting so fucking ridiculous. And you know why it's not going anywhere. Because you need another fucking Shh. Thing nonsense. To Shh. Anyway. Alright, well... Well, we, we had one more thing to talk about, but what was it? Uh, it was... Shit. <laughs> <laughs> we need to, like, write it... Right, that's, that's a new formula, though. It's like when we come across a topic in group chat, yeah. and it sounds good that we could possibly save it for the podcast, we write it down. Yeah, but I got a shit ton of notebooks here in the office, so... Um, Alright, let's just, um... Fuck! Alright, five... Four, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, let's just wrap it up. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> you want to do it or you want me to? Yeah, go, go for it. If yeah. you want to, go for yeah. it. Hello. Thank you for joining us on this podcast. We hope that you enjoyed to listen and it wasn't too awkward or uncomfortable. And if you enjoyed Can't it... Can't say it wasn't boring. Eat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And if you enjoyed it, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. There's plenty more videos to check out. We also have t- uh, news videos every week. Yes. And we have Let's Plays also. Every, <laughs> so often, we're trying. We're, yeah. We're okay. trying. Yeah. Uh, you can check out all those videos on our playlist. We have a podcast playlist, Let's Play playlist, and news uh, real playlist. So, yeah. And also, if you want to just get caught up on possible events or status updates or any kind of pictures that we could post, check, check out, out our Facebook page. And our Twitter. And our Twitter. And we'll keep you updated. And this is Joshua Carlin. This is Joshua Bingo. Josh Square, oh my god! I'm the only one that's different. My name's Matt. I'm special! I'm special, guys! I'm special! And thank you for joining us on this podcast. We'll see you guys next time.